and yes it's a Thursday night which means midweek bonanza time how's this for the start I've not even got me rod in yet I think it's the ghosty have you got that ghosty what you was after last time yeah, we have. You have, you've got the little enemy. ghosty. We've got my arch enemy. The one that was doing you off the top. Yeah, it's done me off the top a few times as well. Not, it's not going off the bottom though, has it? No. Have you just cast that out? About, it's been in 10 minutes. Bloody hell. I put it down to me. Skill. The mix, what I've got. Whoa. Tell us more, Stu, you have to. No, I can't. <laughs> Is it a secret mix? Secret mix. Nice. That was a good start. Right, it was eh? not the kiss of death, but it won't be. Where is he? Oh, he's going for it now. Oh, he's going. Oh, they haven't even got me rod in yet. Just made one rig up. I'm just getting a catfish rig, I think, Billy. Did you? The other rod. He screamed off. I've not even got my mic on or anything. Have you not? <laughs> Wasn't expecting a fish yet. Yeah. Nice I don't want to bully it, I just want to get one under the bank. On the bank, sorry. Under your belt and on the bank? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> under yeah, your bank? Yeah, both. <laughs> as soon as I've got one on the bank, in the belt, on the pocket. Oh, it's not bad. It's ghosting my loafs, that, innit? Yeah, yeah. The one. She's the one. She's been messing me around. It's one of them, anyway. Well, it's Jesus. Probably one of the quickest bites we've ever had doing fishing, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, you don't want to bully it. Oh, no, Stu! I knew that was going to happen. No, it's done you again, old ghosty. Old ghosty face has done me. <laughs> That's the face of a done by a ghosty. <laughs> oh, I don't believe it. I knew, I knew, for some reason, I just thought, I'm not going to bully this. <laughs> Should have bullied it. Do you reckon? No. You can't bully him, can you? No. Oh, well. At least I've had one on the road, eh? Hey. Let's get back at him. As you've seen, Stu just um, lo unfortunately lost a fish. A uh, bit gutting, never mind. Plenty, um, plenty more time. He's only been fishing 10 minutes. I didn't even have my rods in the water. So, yeah. Um, he's a bit gutted, but like you said, there's plenty more time. We've got here late today. Um, it's took, it usually takes me about 25 minutes to get here, and today it's took me and Stu two and a half hours. Uh, the M56 was closed, got stuck in traffic, absolute nightmare. Tried to try to go different ways past Lim through Stretton and all this. Anyway, they were all just chocker. And in the end, just took us two and a half hours to get here, so we're running a bit behind. Um, let's say Stu's just had one, so it's not all that bad. Had a nice run, so yeah, he's been after that common. He was after that common off the top um, the other day, and he kept kept taking his bait and then spitting it out, and like not taking it properly, and he couldn't get it. So he thought he'd um, he thought he'd done it then, but it's done him again, like the third time. Well, never mind. Anyway, it's plenty of time, plenty of time. So, I'm going to have a catch up with Stu. House is up. Just got my rods in now. Um, Stu, well, obviously, Stu's redone his rods now. He's he's back in. So, yeah, hopefully, we're in for, a, in for a couple of fish at least, or one fish at least. I'm fishing one, one for the carp and one for the cats. So, we'll see. We'll see um, what happens. Thought to do one of each tonight, just keeping me keeping my eye on the um, I've got the dumbbell rig on. So I'm just keeping my eye on that now. So I'm fishing just one in front of me a few rod lengths out, just in open water for the carp. And then I've got one over there, which is on the um, dumbbell rig. Stu just redoing his um, rod from that fish he lost. Never mind. Um, where are you fishing, Stu? Uh, I'm fishing <laughs> to the right of this. Is it a willow or this this oh, bush? All oh, right, right, right to the island, right yeah, inside the just, island. Just to the right where all the fishing is. <laughs> the fishing's on top of my feet. 
And where's your, is that, and where's your cat rod? My cat rod is just under oh, it. Oh, yeah. Oh, right, so you're, you're down the sides here, are you? Right. Yeah, so that's where he's fishing. Seen some fizzing down there before, you know, near that. Oh, nice. So it looks like we've got this bottom quarter covered anyway. And Stu's in again. <laughs> the same fish. You never know. <laughs> I've done it. I think I had the same two fish, didn't I? Coming in easier. That's the spot that tonight. It is, isn't it? Where was that from? Same on that corner. That corner again. You said it was fizzing up, didn't you? Yeah, come on, don't lose this one, Stu. Come on, try your bestest. <laughs> Trying to take the other rod. Oh, it's going to. <laughs> Waking up now, isn't it? Hmm. Oh, lad. I've just got both rods in, haven't I? It's about, about half eight now, you know, Stu. It's gone quick tonight, hasn't it? Because we got stuck in that traffic. No, I don't think so. These pegs are so tight, they need sorting out. Oh, no, they are too tight, aren't they? Too tight. I ain't bullying this one. <laughs> no. I've got it out the other side here. Yeah. Can't uh, get your landing net to go. Come on. Let's have him in the net, Stu. Go on, get in, lad. He's in! Yes. Two runs in two hours or something like that. Well, probably an hour, hour. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Ow. Happy birthday big to me. Oh, oh yeah, it's your birthday, isn't it? <laughs> I, I knew it was going to go. That, that corner was... You did, crazy. you kept saying, didn't you? It's head off. I knew it was going to go. Nice one, Stu, right? Let's sort ourselves out and have a look at it. Aye. There's Stu's fish. <laughs> it's having none of it, is it? Is that... It's not the same fish you had with a week, is it? No, it's no like mine's um, common. So, look. Can we lift it a bit high? Ooh. Down. <laughs> it's not having it. <laughs> it does your head in, doesn't it? When you keep flipping, you're trying to pick them up. Gotta lift it up a bit more. That's it. That's it. <laughs> well, Stu, you're ripping it. You're ripping it pieces what tonight. Do you reckon? 13, 14. Yeah, somewhere around that, yeah. Not big, is it? Nice so, have a look at the other side. Quick. Nice. <laughs> keeps wanting to go in, keeps wanting to flip, doesn't it? So on that, Stu. Get her back in. Top, top rod. Get another one. Oh, aye. It's not the most gracious of releases, this. Yeah, but look at yeah, what we've got to play I, with. I the, the swims are horrendous. There it goes. Well, Stu's doing well. He's had um, two runs and one fish landed. I've had diddly squat yet. But um, anyway, it happened this at Founders. 
they had nothing till one o'clock in the morning and he had a bloody five five cats that's not going to happen here like but i do think this bottom end is usually well i found it more for the cats but that was a, that was years ago when it was the other stock of fish but i always did better for the cats down here to be honest but we'll see i've had i've had note nothing no bleeps nothing yet but i think i think um stew's stew's gonna get another one i think he's on for a third run because his spot's still fizzing up i just had a quick walk over and um yeah it's still fizzing up i'm gonna get a brew now because it's coming up to nine o'clock it's flipping flown tonight you no know, we're getting here dead late it's, it's gone too quick going better than an hour and a half we've got work in the morning and I don't feel like relaxed I don't feel relaxed from um, all the driving and bloody sat in traffic so anyway we'll see if we'll see if you get to another fish I'll, I've got a feeling he's going to get another one before it goes dark or before we go to bed hopefully I'll nick one or something we'll see we'll see right so another brew catch up with you in a bit How bad was that journey down here? I was telling them how. Oh my god. It was horrendous. Two hours and 15 minutes to do what? From my house, it's probably only 12 mile, if that. I know. We so, were literally bumper to bumper from leaving my house. It was bad. It was bad. I wonder what happened. We still don't know what happened, do we? No, I might have a little googly in a minute, see what happens. We've shut up motorway, so something bad's happened, hasn't it? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Well, at least, at least you've had a couple of fish now. Yeah. Anyway, it's made up for it. Yeah. Oh, I just need a run now. But it could be our turn tonight, Stu. Could be our turn. At last, <coughs> excuse me, at last, half past three and my rod's finally gone and I've got myself a nice common. Um, probably the aerator in the background, it's quite noisy. I've actually got to sleep tonight as well. I've had a few liners, kept getting a few little beeps and then um, about an hour and a half later it's, it's gone. Jesus, and it's it's bonkers this one I'm trying to rock it before it's going absolutely mad but, um, very long very long common long but um, shallow but quite fat along the shoulders I think it's a mid double but uh, it's dead long just yeah nice long common Oh, there we go. Bit better. Cracking fish. Didn't fight that well, I'll be honest. Until it got on the mat. Oh. Absolutely mint fish though. Mint fish. Got a mark on it. Which the same for the last last one he had was absolutely mint as well I know the new fish but yeah they are pretty pretty mint so I've just set my rod up ready to do there's not much room on these swims I can't I couldn't rest the fish Jesus I couldn't rest the fish 
I'd had my, rod, my two rods fishing at the same time because the gap in the reeds is that small. It's a bit of a nightmare really, so I'm about to sort my rods out. Be ready to cast in now. Um, put some bait together. Just doing this and then I'm going to then get, get my rods back out. Before it starts coming light, it's back. I think it's probably quarter to four now, maybe it'll look a bit later. So yeah, right, let's get this little bugger back. <laughs> I've just felt some rain. I can, f I can feel rain. What happened, Stu? I had big hopes for you last night. I thought... No, last night in the darkness. You said you were going to have two fish. After liner, after liner, on both rods as well, on the cat rod. I think it, I, th I honestly think it was carp picking the bait up. I didn't have a tap. I had a big, I had big, 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 um... They're big ones, aren't they? Like 30 mil. Well, they're big oversized Rolos. Yeah. <laughs> big. I, I had two of them. I had a 22. I think they were 30 together. So, I was targeting cats. I don't know, would a cat get on them down? Them down? I reckon they're just picking the, the, the top one up. Yeah, probably. And lifting it up and my bobby was just going to meet um, But yeah, it wasn't to be on No. I got up at three when I had that fish and I seen your little receiver light on from down there. Yeah. The purple light. Yeah, it was, it was as you were fumbling around, I was getting a few liners and then stopped. But I slept well last night, me. I did. Did you? I did, yeah, because then I got up as well. I think it's because it's cooler. Yeah, yeah, I did sleep well. So, yeah, at least we didn't blank, eh? I know. Birthday bonanza and didn't blank. Birthday bonanza. And if I'd have played my cards right, I'd have had that old ghost, didn't I? Yep, I oh, know. I fluffed it because I said I'm, I'm not going to bully it. I'm not going to bully it. And you were saying bully it, bully it. No, don't be blaming <laughs> me. <laughs> don't be trying to blame me. <laughs> no, to be fair, I fluffed it. <laughs> well, I don't think anything else is going to happen, is it, Steve? Oh, well, listen, I've just thrown ten boilies over me. My area of, of where my upbait is, and I've already had two liners within five minutes. So never say never. I'm I'm holding hope for a last knockins. I had a last knockins on here last time with my carp, last half an hour when I was blanking. It doesn't normally happen for me that. No, last it doesn't happen. Theory. It doesn't normally happen, but hopefully this time it will. Yeah. Oh. Now we're going to have to have a pat down, I think it's going on a bit, isn't it? Uh, I think it's about... Oh, I fell back asleep here this morning. I, I knew you did. Did you get me wake-up call? Yeah, yeah. But because you didn't answer it back before, I'm going to have to follow that up in a minute and, and actually wake him up. No, I, I woke up, but the alarm was a bit too early, and then um, I thought I'd just have ten minutes, the next minute, half an hour passed. There's the secret ingredient. The secret bait from last night. Secret bait. Can't see it. Didn't it. Do very you can't well. see it. <laughs> it didn't do me very well. <laughs> Garlic in it. Oh, hey. they like a bit of garlic, don't they? Well, Stu, I think I'm going to pack down quick because it's starting to rain. I'm going to get drenched here, aren't we? Well, I'm not bothered. I, I am. <laughs> well, we'll catch you Very next nice. time. We'll catch you next time. I don't know what's going to happen next week because I'm away on Friday, so we might not have time for a, a midweek bonanza. I don't know. We'll see, won't we? Could, could end up on the rivers for a, an after work Cheeky session. One, yeah. Could end up on the rivers and just be old for one yeah. o'clock. We might do yeah, we might do a river session, pack up at twelve ish, yeah, for Barbel. Either at the Ribble or one at well, Limwater's a bit far, aren't they? A bit a bit ribble, ribble, bit ribble, yeah. It's only half an hour for us. We've got a little tried and tested spot, haven't we? Well I've I've, I've never caught out. I had my P B and Graham had an eel. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> for, all, for all his effort, he had a little eel. A little eel about fucking. Could have, could have done my shoes up with it, couldn't I? <laughs> right. I think we'll end it there. Unless summer happens, we'll catch you next time.